Hello and welcome to another episode of Jarama Plays the Scourge Bringer. Bring us the Scourge. Bring us your dead. Okay. Uh, we already spent this. So let's just go straight in. Right, 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 right in. Bum, bum, bum. Right in. The good days of Skrillex. You guys remember the Skrillex on its in, in their heyday? Some of you guys are gonna hit me with a. Uh, yeah, I was like 10. And I, uh, you know, you didn't have to go there to make me feel like a. Uh, like I'm 60 years old. <laughs> I bet it's how, like, people felt. Um, like, if people were born in 1965. Or I guess, hold on. If people were born in, like, 1960. And then, uh somebody hits him with the uh, during the 1970s somebody hits him with the remember when the Beatles were popular <laughs> I did not just compare Sonny Moore with the Beatles okay the the talent there <laughs> to be fair they kind of did the same thing it was just a different um, a different time set uh, a different pocket in time is is what I'm trying to say. Um, okay, you're dead. We have eight HP. We're fine. I was about to cry about it, but it's fine. Ooh, mini boss time. Don't spawn in the middle, my dude. I very much highly unrecommend you spawning in the middle. Okay. Um, but yeah, they did kind of the same thing because, uh, just <laughs> okay. Hold on, let me let me get this comparison proper. Um, Sunny Moore, formerly of uh, pfft, you're you're gonna try to make me remember what band he was in. What is it from first to last or something? I don't know. <laughs> as I die, as I lay dying, all the all those bands seem the same to me. I'd, <sighs> Hold on, I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. You know what? Forget it. Um, but he basically created this phenomenon of dubstep that lasted like five years of everybody adding wub 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 into their music. You know that that, that takes a special kind of talent. Ooh, increases combo by 0.5. We don't need it. We don't need it. Double shotgun. Way better. <clears throat> Hello? Can I... Thank you. Oh, we can go to the boss fight already. Do we want to? I think we do. Let's just do it. You know? We're not a coward anymore. We're a grown man. We can take care of our problems. <laughs> Yo, look at us properly handling what life throws at us. Oh boy. <laughs> Spoke too soon. I wonder if you get anything by, like, flawlessing a boss fight. Uh, and don't answer that by the time... You respond to this. You know what? That's not fair. That's not fair. I was going to say I probably would have beaten the game by now. Or <laughs> that's that's presuming that I'm recording like 50 episodes all in one night, which is kind of what I want to do, to be honest. Okay, back to the Skrillex conversation. Uh, Skrillex changed music for like five years. <clears throat> John Lennon and Paul McCartney... And the boys, um, they changed music for the, probably a century. <laughs> we we still we, we are probably still seeing um, the 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 actions that they did uh, with with what with, with their style and um, fusing, you know, like the old school jazz and uh, and swing music to to make the, the they just. You know how there's like the the scientific Christmas music where they they pretty much just uh, 
fused all the parts of what people like in Christmas music. And, um... And created, like, a, the perfect song. Um, first of all, I don't really believe in that. <laughs> because, I guess, I'm, I'm kind of like a music snob. To an extent. Although, I, I'll listen to anything. But if you tell me something's the perfect something, you know, that's just... That's just asking for me to not like it. I think a lot of people will, um... We'll go with me on that. <laughs> we'll oblige. We'll marry Jay Blige with me. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. Okay, so the the tentacle dudes, they shoot out really slow projectiles. We really have to watch out for those. Ouch. Also, have we... Have we... Uh... Reflected any projectiles yet? I think it's so subtle that it might not be something that I... Yo, it's beautiful! It stuns him, too! Uh, it's so funny we were talking about dubstep, and I, I didn't even realize the last time we were playing that level 2 has... Dubstep as the main theme. Uh, you know, level one is obviously thrash metal. Speaking of thrashing metal, get destroyed. <laughs> that felt good. <laughs> uh, I don't know what we did there. That was that was really bad. Boom. But yeah, uh, the Beatles basically did that. They 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 knew what people liked, and then they made it. Um, they made it, then made it, and made it, and made it until they themselves did not want to do it anymore. And they're like, you know what? Let's just uh, let's actually make what we want to make now. <laughs> I don't know. I. I no one can really tell besides them. Um, hold on. Yes, more items is good. Let's go with that. Oh, double minigun. Increases max ammo by 10. Both of these are real good. I think we can purchase both of them. Let's go with that then. Um, yeah, you, you know, it... it, it the thing about songwriting, I feel like, it changes with you. So maybe when they were uh, when they were younger, they really just wanted to make some happy songs, and then, you know, a la Taylor Swift, a la, you know, tons of different artists. They, uh, when you get a little bit older, it's less about fun and more about uh, influence. Although I feel like Taylor Swift's kind of just writing that. I keep on talking about Taylor Swift. Is it just because of that stupid Netflix movie, man? Um, which was really good, by the way. It's a really good documentary. It felt like a like a Shane Dawson one, you know. Um, it really like took you into the mind, you know. <gasps> Someone you don't really even want to feel sorry for, you start feeling sorry for. Yeah, because you're like you make. Insane money doing something that I would probably really love doing as well. <clears throat> but I wouldn't want to deal with the controversies that you deal with, like Kanye West being an idiot just for more attention. Um, good, 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 good. Okay, we're fine. Ooh, HP, thank you, sir. Do you think it's greed? that we're staying this long yes I'll, I'll answer it for you we're staying this long without fighting the uh, the boss we really should just go and fight the boss already yo that was beautiful we re we should ground pound more often <laughs> you know 
<sighs> okay. Um, the, the slow bullets really get me. Also, what's my <clears throat> count for, uh, for this, <laughs> for this playthrough? <laughs> if this game just makes you want to do the, uh, the down with the sickness thing. The, <laughs> is that from down with the sickness? I think it is. Hold on. Uh, three HP, by the way. We need to, uh, we need to calm down. We're being too loud. But yeah, people are more interested about being influencers nowadays, usually. Um, right after they, they become uh, more <laughs> like popular because of how fun they are. I don't know. I guess it's all about like legacy issues and yeah, you start thinking about your identity and what you're known for and then you're like, I don't know if I, if I want to be known for this and I want to be known as the person who changed the world and not so much the person that just made a song. <laughs> okay, this is not HP. So we're going to go say hi to the second floor boss and uh, probably die. What are you? Candle mask. It's chandelier here. It's chandelier here. Oh boy. Oh boy. I want to say more than hello. No. The laser beam to the right. Okay. We said hello. <laughs> Can you hear me? I wish uh, I wish Adele did more. I wonder what she's doing nowadays. Did she retire? I don't know. I know Nicki Minaj retired, but I don't know why those two in my head are kind of in the same echelon. Uh, combos break 25% slower. Very nice. Completely stop close to shops or altars. <clears throat> what do we have here? Fury. Hello. That's totally way more worth it. Oh, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. No, we need one more. We need one more uh, eyeball thing. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. So it, this game is is kind of going the Hades route of roguelites that I uh, I'm not like a huge huge fan of. But I get it. They're they're kind of treating it like a tutorialization, and I I should be less of a snob about it than I am. I know, but like into the gungeon and like and in the uh, spelunky and and binding of Isaac, they just do it so right, you know. <laughs> you you get spoiled and slay the spire. To be fair. I was, I'm, I'm reading through all of those. Okay, uh, minus Spelunky. All of the, well, which Spelunky is the closest thing to a roguelike. Uh, if you're in the conversation. Um, the only thing you can unlock is like floor upgrades where you can go straight to a, the second or third or fourth floor. And it's like, that of, you don't even want to do that. Because you're not going to have any money. You're not going to have the... The Ujit eye, you're not gonna have the the Ankh, etc. etc. Like, that's not how you play Spelunky. So it's a it's a roguelike. Um yeah. But I get it to a huge extent, Gungeon and Isaac being like some of the top tier roguelikes out there. They do the same exact thing, just like, they gatekeep by hiding f more fun content, quote unquote, um, by um, having you play more. Like, you earn currency or you just earn stuff by doing specific things. I prefer the, the latter of those two, by the way, you know, the Smash Brothers Melee version of unlocking stuff. Um, I know it's... <clears throat> it's not liked by the casual crowd. 
And it's like, oh man, I'm never gonna have to. I'm not. I'm never gonna be able to to play as Ness because I can't beat normal without a retry. You know what? Then find a friend that can beat it for you, <laughs> or you know, you didn't. You didn't earn it. You already gave. You gave up before you gave it a chance. Like I believe in you. You can do it. I don't know. That's a very boomer take. <laughs> I don't have many of those. I don't think. <sighs> but suck it up. <laughs> suck it up and do it the hard way. You got to do hard things sometimes. Um, and also, speaking of doing hard things sometimes, uh, I probably should have just teleported. I know somebody's going to take that quote out of context. Um, let's just... Yo, that's a lot of enemies. Got him. Got him. And got him. Okay. Okay. There we go. Mini gun. Do you need raw firepower? I do. I do need raw firepower. But max ammo and HP is also real nice. Um... I think the minigun's gonna take us further. And so let's go ahead and save up for that. Ooh, what are we gonna get here? 5% shop disc. <laughs> okay. Um, that gives us nothing right now. You know what? These are really tough, actually, to choose from. <laughs> I turned my nose up to the reloading energy, but I didn't realize how much I actually do use it. I spam it quite a bit, especially in boss fights. I'll just go with the HP though. Three HP. I can't say no. It's it's not a it's not a bad choice. Like obviously. Yo, another one! DJ Khaled! I was gonna say, is he still doing stuff? But I think I literally just saw him in like a Super Bowl commercial. I guess that doesn't technically mean that you're doing stuff. I mean, Michael Buble was in a Super Bowl commercial and... Um... I think all he does is the Christmas album. He tries to write his own stuff, but... Uh, <laughs> you know, you can only be so much Frank S Sinatra. <laughs> or so much like, Frank Sinatra! Fly me to the moon. Let's see among the stars. Okay. Um, let's go back to the shop. <clears throat> We cannot buy both. Wait, hold on. So six, seven. Okay, that's over seven hundred. Let's go with the mini gun. You know, if we have the money after this boss fight, yes, we're talking like we could just destroy this boss fight now. I love this this new chapter of our life. Let's experience it together. By the way, I'm mashing square for all you naysayers about the. Uh, <laughs> I probably shouldn't be. I could probably move more uh, precise with my movement if I wasn't mashing square. Actually, I'm li I'm literally testing it out right now, and it's it's awesome. It's awesome. I could I could stay exactly where I want just by holding down square. Um, Six fifty. Okay, so we can purchase one of these. Okay. Um, let's go with build, uh, with this one. I mean, I feel like that's just the obvious choice. Let's go. I'm just enjoying the music for a second. Because I, I don't think we, we got to appreciate it quite yet. Oh. 
It's good usage of the double, double strum. Boom, let's go, let's go. Okay, okay, I'm feeling it. I'm really feeling it, Mr. Krabs. 13 HP. Show me that that boss fight. Hold on, no, we wanna we wanna get the shrine at least. So we can have some sort of upgrades going. Ooh, the drill. There's a lot of things that trip you up from just wanting to, like, the, the first area really makes you want to just zip around everywhere. A lot of the monsters in the second area, um, they, they deter you from zipping around everywhere. Um, okay, cool. Alright, so we see the shrine on the bottom, and then we also see the shop to the left right here. It's worth checking out, obviously. Jukes. I I love it. It's like it, it's a heavy metal glitch mob. Boom. <laughs> Um, gives back one HP and fully reloads. Okay, oh, well, mm, that's really cheap for that. It's really cheap for that. Um, we'll just go with these. I think, don't we already have a minigun? I don't know, I can't tell. You gotta give credit where credit's due. I just wanted the game to breathe for a second there. I feel like, uh, you know, appreciation for the background music is always good. Um, that's something that I, I think Gungeon and Isaac in particular uh, aren't like heavily touted for, but they have the music down right. You know, each one of the, they kind of have the same vibe of this game, to be honest. Uh, hold on. 5% more damage per missing each. <laughs> uh, more items. You know, more items. Uh, it seems to always be a good thing. <laughs> Got him. Got him, okay. Oh, that was a risky move. Okay, increases damage on stunned enemies, very nice. Um, I think we're we're ready. Let's just go fight the boss. <clears throat> I wanna learn as much as I can. You know, uh, roguelites, uh, just like languages is what I always say. Um, you learn by doing, and in, uh, in languages, Specifically, you learn by speaking it. That's kind of something we're uh, we're trying to tinker with with our daughter right now. Uh, she is like 19 months old, I think, something like that. Okay, gotta focus, gotta focus. Dong dong daka dong daka. Oh my, the beams though. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh, the spray, I wasn't ready for the spray. I was ready for the beam, but I could not follow the spray there. Okay. Oh, my voice is going out. <laughs> we just beat the second boss. <sighs> Feeling good. I'm feeling real good about that one. 
Let's check out this third level, the Wasted Pit. Ooh. Went from regular pit to dark pit. Now he's gone to the bar. <laughs> and he's, he's come back home and he's wasted? I don't know. <laughs> um, immediately right off the bat we've got environmental issues. We got, oh my, okay. We got explodey thingies. Lots more things to keep an eye on. Oh, I will, <laughs> no. I don't know, I don't know about this Mr. Krabs. Okay, um. <laughs> this is insane. First of all, I, if you haven't noticed my pace, has pretty much like for, for, in comparison to the first level my pace is absolutely slowed down to a halt if it's not obvious um, and I, I think it's very much intentional to like to, to, to try to slow you down because that just like with the with the drill just like with the beams you know, they're adding the difficulty very wisely. <gasps> no, 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 no. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, run. You know, much respect to this game. For, uh, for something that's quote-unquote in beta slash early access, this is the level of polish in, in this difficulty, uh, bump. And um, I don't know. I, I'm I'm having a heck of a time. At this rate, we're gonna post double videos for a whole week. <laughs> See how that goes. <laughs> I joke, but maybe not. <laughs> maybe we maybe we don't joke about that, and we do do that. Indeed, indeed. Ah, okay. 2 HP. Oof. Oh. Take a breather. Take as long of a breather as necessary. I'm a fan of the uh, the quads. Not not really the muscle quads. I mean, I guess those are fine too if if you got nice quads. Um, but I'm talking about the the drum line quads. They typically play. I was part of marching band slash concert band when I was younger, um, and I was just gonna say that I played bass on it and it was really awkward. Um, let's check out what we have here. Uh, but yeah, the quads were always an interesting instrument because they would just. They they would be the toms like they tr act like they were part of the snare group. No, I'm part of the cool group. I could just hit this one. It's basically a snare. It's not a snare. I'm sorry, bud. Uh, we're gonna unlock fury. Uh, allows to prioritize an attack zone during the fury. Hmm. Prioritize attack zone. What is this? Smashed enemies are. <laughs> I. I can't just. <laughs> this is this is too good. Yes. Smashing an item from greed, will transmute it into another random item. You gonna re-roll? Oh my goodness! Oh my. Go oh my goodness! Compass, what does that do? Okay, we're gonna do the re-roll here um, But yeah, thank you so much for watching the video Thanks for all the support That I am preemptively thinking that these videos are gonna get but I don't know it doesn't matter I'm having fun. So I hope you're having fun as well hit that like button if you did indeed like the button uh, If you like the button if you like the, uh, the, the Content slash me hit that sub button to support the channel. I will catch you on the next one. See you